Okay, so if you can't tell, I'm in a very, very summer mood and wanted to work with bright colors. And that was perfect for this week's prompt, which was joyous. And I like replacing letters with different types of objects to still make it look like a word, but it has a little bit of pop and interest to it. So I replaced the O in joy with a hibiscus flower because they're a flower that's commonly associated with summer. This particular piece had a lot of layering. So there was a lot of laying down base colors, waiting for them to dry and going over them again. I had to do some erasing with the little eraser that was in the box. And then I started adding in all of my shadows and highlights. And for the black shadows with letters, it's important to make sure that you only place the blacks on the one side where you're doing shadows, not randomly all over the place. Same thing with your highlights. You want them to only be on one side of your letters. And I just went and filled in those letters with some fun stripes. And I added some borders and extra details to the flower. Remember, you do have to wait for your layers to dry before you add on these whites and blacks on top.